Susan, I'm oh, so yeah. glad you showed up today. I was worried. Hi. Sorry, I've been so busy recently. It's so nice to finally see you again after all this time. Since when do they have so much meat at this restaurant? The menu hasn't changed since the last time we were here. Are you sure? It's been a while. Do they have vegan meals? Vegan? Oh my god, you're vegan now? What do you eat? Oh, you're lactose intolerant, right? I'm just cruelty intolerant. And yes, obviously I eat food. But that's an extreme diet. Yeah, totally. Extremely healthy and extremely considerate of other sentient beings. Honey, Tim, are you listening? Yeah, of course. Susan, I thought you're vegetarian, not vegan. What? How do you know that? Susan, I thought you ate meat. Uh, well, a lot of people start off as vegetarians and decide to go into a fully vegan lifestyle. Okay, yeah, that's really interesting. I didn't know that. Everything all right, Zoe? Zoe? Are you okay? Sorry, I was just inside for a moment. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> it's actually pretty funny because I've been looking for my black boots for like two weeks now and I just found them on your feet. What a coincidence, no? <laughs> That's really funny. You must have the same taste when it comes to shoes. Yeah, actually I bought them like two days ago. Oh really? So they have them again? Because I thought they were out of stock. That's cool, I can buy them again now. Sorry Tim that I've been so upset with you about that. I have been annoying Tim the whole time because I couldn't understand what happened to them. But now I know that I could just have put new ones. <laughs> It's fine. I'm used to you being upset. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been together now? Uh, about <laughs> five years. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Time passes by so fast. Okay, I'm gonna use the restroom for a minute. Why the fuck are you wearing her shoes? It was a coincidence. Do you think I can see anything when you push me out of your apartment in the middle of the night because your wife comes home? I just picked a random shoe. I can't go barefoot when it's freezing outside. That's not what I'm talking about. Why the fuck are you wearing her shoes today in this restaurant when you knew you were going to meet her? As I said, it was a coincidence. I just picked the wrong shoe. Forget about it. And calm down. Nothing happened. Anyways, she needs to know about us sometime. But not now! <laughs> What's wrong? What were you guys chatting about? Oh, nothing special. Actually, we wanted to... Um, actually, I just told him how great it is to live with you. Oh, thank you. The food here is so good, I can't get over it. It is. Last time we were here, I ate the same thing and I still love it. Yeah. So didn't you also eat the same dish? Oh yes, I did. Uh, 
I can't remember. Have we been here together before? Why did you come here together? Oh, <clears throat> I don't know. Was it only the two of us, Susan? Mm, no, no. Um, I think there were other friends too. Uh, how, how do you like the food? Uh, every, everything okay? Too hot, too cold, too salty? <laughs> it's amazing. Yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me for, for asking so much about the food, but we, we just got a, um, a, a new chef this week. So uh, ev everything completely different, new menu. Oh, a new menu for only one week? Yes, uh, everything completely different. Oh. Okay, enjoy. Well, I guess you guys met this week here? You could have told me it's the first place. Hey, can you understand me? Zoe, you said you want to meet here because we haven't seen Susan for about one year and a half. Do you want to tell me something? Are you planning a secret project or what? Well, first of all, I want to know what the fuck your secret project with Susan is. What are you talking about? Do you think I'm dumb? I know that she's wearing my shoes. Nobody else has them. They were custom made for me. And you can obviously not buy them. And how did you know that she was vegetarian before she decided to go vegan? Your imagination is so big. <laughs> yeah, sure. Shut up. Susan, what do you have to say? Nothing? Well, somebody has to tell the truth. So, so what? what? This might sound crazy. But I have been meeting you both at the same time. I'm in love with you both, and I couldn't choose between one of you. You ruined everything, Susan. You crazy bitch.